bothering me. I'm here to show you some <laughs> vouchers about our Lord. <laughs> our Lord, Mr. Trump. Hello, everyone. We are playing Encodia. On the last video, no, not in the last video. In the past few videos, we found out that our father has some sort of an important secret to show us. Secret that we'd be enough, importantly enough, to save the world. And we just found out our father's name. I mean, our Tina's father. Sam is um, kind of his, her second father. Yeah, we can, we can assume. I mean, he took care of her. So, yeah. But basically, not to make a long story short, <laughs> I put a whole bag of- no, I'm kidding, kidding. Um, to make a long story short, we're trying to figure out who our dad was so that we can find out what the secret code is and what it holds so we can save the world. <laughs> okay, so we, we now have the print of a missing person ticket and we got the adult sign authorization. We can now visit the registry archive. Let's talk to the receptionist and say that we got what she wants us to have. Yes. Yes. Here we go. Regarding the registry. Mm-hmm. Here's the form. Can I use the archives now? Let me check the form. Hmm. Yes. Good. Seriously? This is how long you need to process a one-line form? Hmm. This day. I wonder if it's filled out properly. I'd hate to ask you to return tomorrow with a correctly filled out form. But if you keep rushing me... Okay, okay. Take your time. Huh. I see the date is okay after all. The form has been filed. You can now proceed to view the Neo Berlin Archive. Great. Enjoy the night. Thank you very much, annoying receptionist. Let's go. Ooh! We're one step closer into finding out what secrets our dad holds. Nothing here. Analyzing. Checking every single nook and cranny. Okay. Archive terminal? The archive terminal he here. Uh just checking everything out. Lockers, okay. They don't have anything to show me. Okay. Okay. Okay, everything seems clean. Alright, let's check the archive then. Neo Berlin Registry Office Citizen Data. Welcome to MV version 1.6C copyright uh, Chaos Monger Studio 2001 2062. Current date is December 2, 2062. Please enter the name to research. Oh dear. Oh, I have to choose? Ren Herzog, it's here. Ran Herzog. It's the right name, right? Herzog, yeah. Born in Munich, 30th April, 2025. This gentleman is younger than me. <laughs> Weird. <laughs> Moved to Neo Berlin after its establishment in 2041, where he specialized in cyberspace, cyberspace technology in high school, and later at the University of Neo Berlin. After completing a few minor contracts, he started started work at Cybergaia Corporation 2048, engaged to Hannah Asimov in 2050. The two had a daughter, Tina. It's her! Tina Asimov Herzog, born in 2053. Hey! So we're 2023, 33... No, uh, no, 20, yeah, 23, 33, 43, 53, 30 years later, right? 
If I made my calculations correctly, I'm not good at numbers. 30 years later, my god, we're living in a past. <laughs> Uh, okay, um, he was reported missing in September 2054 and has since been declared dead. Hannah Asimov was reported the dead to... Is closed now. Please return tomorrow morning. No, no, I didn't finish reading. Hannah Asimov was reported dead in 2059, cause cyberspace overdose. No data about Tina Asimov Herzog since 2059. During his time in Neon Berlin, during his time in Neo Berlin, Ren Herzog has been tracked most frequently at Neo tracked at Neo Berlin residential area sector G9. Should I save this? Neo Berlin residential area. Wait, I don't know if I should save this. Where I'm going to save it? Sector. G9 30010 Block Seam and Neo Berlin Business Street I'm just gonna take a print screen of this. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Business Street Cyber Gaia Corporation Office F13. The registry office is closed now. Bro, oh, I can the print file! <laughs> it's all true then. I had a father. <laughs> yes, Tina. And if we want to discover more about him, we should visit his old office in the flat where we all used to live. I don't remember much about the old flat. Me neither. I guess the loss of your mother was a trauma for both of us. Hmm. I don't want to think about it. Let's see what we can find out about Dad. Hmm. Okay, let me just... Um, let me just... I'll, I'll, I'll get out soon. Let me just make a, another... A less check to this. Okay, we, we got it all. Visit the old flat. Visit Tina's father's old office. Let's go then. If everything's... If we got everything over here, no need to waste any more time. Let me just... Okay, let's go. Oh, this song is so beautiful. Is the old flat on the map? Residential area, crossroad, downtown. Wow, this song is so beautiful. <laughs> I always shut up every time this song shows up. So soothing. It's a very soothing game. I was about to say movie. <laughs> One more poster of that swine. Okay. Uh, okay. Uh, let's see. Let's see. There's a robot there. I saw it. I saw it. I was just checking out. If okay. Guess. Guess we're good to. Good to go. Excuse me. I can't understand a single word. Let me try Sam. See if it. Hello, humanoid Troy. Hello, model Sam. What can I do for you? Uh, you know my deleted memories are coming back piece by piece. Do you even know her? from somewhere to be talking to her like that as if you knew her year in years you know, my deleted <laughs> memories are coming back piece by piece and I'm sure I've walked past this bridge many times ah, but okay. I don't remember you who are you? I'm Gia Troy Gia is the name of my owner and Troy 
Well, it's because I'm a droid. Get it. And a very pretty one. Indeed. Oh, don't flatter me. <laughs> you seem in distress. Is everything all right? You seem in distress. Is everything all right? Not really. I can't move. I've been here for days. Oh. Is your RAM faulty? My RAM? No. My RAM is good. It's my DNA. DNA? What do you mean? I thought only humans had DNA. I'm a unique droid, specially built to take care of a human being. And I contain a code that reacts to her DNA. <gasps> it's Gina! I've never heard of a droid like you. It's because I was built by Gina's mother, part of a secret experiment. Where is your human now? My human Gia left me a few months ago. She grew old. Oh, okay. She was too busy streaming all the time. Oh, okay. And she simply got rid of me. That's super sad. I hope Tina will never abandon me. Don't worry, Sam. I'll never leave you. Anyway, Aww. Being away from her DNA slowly affected my functionality. I lost some of my limbs, so I had to replace them with scraps. And since Tuesday, I can't move anymore. I'm stuck here, and no one cares. This is one of the saddest robot stories I've ever heard. Yeah. How can I help you? How can I help you? Gia always wears a double helix bracelet. It contains her DNA sequence, and also her location. If you can bring it to me, I'll be able to restore my data and walk again. Okay. We will ask Gia to give you her bracelet. What an ass! She left her babysitter robot in the street? Once I can walk again, Ugh. I'll find her and talk to her myself. She wasn't all wrong to abandon me. She Why? grew up, but I kept treating her like a child. The first thing that she should hear about me Like is a mother a does. Alright, we'll try our best to get Gia's bracelet and come back. Thank you very much. See you later. I said I said Tina before because she said it only only reacts to the DNA and her father in the video said that whatever it is he had for her only reacted to, to her DNA that's why I said that but it's the but it's not Tina it's the kid from the uh, that was on the uh, uh, Italian diner you remember where, where the singer was trapped that one the one that has uh, her tiktok fans it's not tiktok but you know what i mean Le left the poor the poor the poor robot in there on the floor god damn it guess having a bunch of likes is way better than have actual love from someone i say this as i have a youtube channel <laughs> <laughs> Where the only interaction you can have with me is by commenting, liking, and sub. Comment, like, and subscribe. Comment, like, and subscribe. Like her, I'm also selfish and want likes. <laughs> you found me. You found my. You found that I am full of it. E, so many doors. I suppose I'm not going to be able to go through through in any of them, so uh, they'll let me let me see. I can't. I need the code or someone to open it from inside. Yeah, I also presume that, but intercom? I don't want to disturb people. Very well, then I guess there's nothing for us here. Resist! The power of Zeus is with you! And posters, okay. I guess I didn't see anything on the floor. Residential bridge, let me just see four, four. Floor 02, 02. See if there's anything different. Let's skip up a bit. Okay. As. 2G13 Oh man, I hope these are not codes 2G13 I already saved uh, another one, Wh which one was it? GTH73 AS, oh my god, I think these are actual codes 
because the other one was GTH73 and this one is AS2G3. Oh, are these actual codes? Let me just underline this. All right. I think I think these are. I can't. I know. I know. I know. I know. I know. I know. Okay, floor three. Okay, camera. Nothing here, nothing here, nothing here, nothing here. The Statue of Liberty! Chaos Munger. And a cool drawing of a lady with glasses. Is that a, a human ver version of the um, of the receptionist? Wow! Whoa! The song is flipping. Okay, floor four. I hope I didn't miss any items. Would be a bummer to have to go through this again. Okay. Nice graffiti, good looking graffiti, love it. An S. Awesome looking S. And something you can barely see in yellow, but it's there. Oh, aha! Okay, old music player. Looney. <laughs> oh, or Loney. Let's see. An old device to listen to audio tapes. Loney, okay. Okay, I guess we're good. Neo Berlin security campaign. Happy... Oh, I didn't read any. I didn't read everything. Okay. Okay. Floor three. Floor two. Floor one. Residential bridge. Which was where we... Maybe... But I don't have any cassette tapes. I'm probably gonna need cassette tapes, right? I bet I'm gonna... I'm gonna need to record something. And Sam's gonna be like, I don't have a, a cassette tape. I'm gonna need to find a cassette tape. But let me try. Who knows? It needs to be plugged into a sound system to play music. I know. I know. I think I do. I think I do. All right. So we know what we must do. We gotta go. We work. I don't even have to waste time <laughs> going all the way through. I can immediately jump here. Yeah, dude. It's still in cyberspace and probably not leaving anytime soon. Diner, Ranzo's diner, and we're probably gonna plug the cassette tape into the mixer whoops well, let's do this huh? oh wait I should have oh sorry I should have picked up the bracelet while she was distracted. Again. Huh? <laughs> have a nice day. <laughs> Bye. Done. Done. <laughs> huh? Like Sam, this huge robot. <laughs> 
<laughs> She's going like, huh? And a huge hand going, <laughs> so, subtle, subtle, smooth, ninja like. <laughs> huh? And this huge hand. Okay, here we go. Let's save the poor, the poor lady, the poor lady robot, the poor robot. Let's help her out. Awesome. With the sequence coded in here, I can walk again. And it also shows me Gia's location. I'll go visit her. I can't wait. Good luck. I hope she'll drop her transmitter then. What? Oh, nothing. Well, <laughs> I'll make sure she stops being online 24-7. Yeah. Great. Goodbye. Goodbye. Yay. A few, a few minutes later. I don't need a nanny anymore. You haven't needed a nanny since you were eight. What do you mean? It was me who needed you to feel like my existence still has meaning. Just like your transmitter, all I am is the purpose you give me. You should go home, Gia. Mother probably didn't even notice I was gone. You won't be going back for her sake. You should come home with me, GD. Nice. I'm glad. I mean, I think it's a happy ending, right? Let's go back there and see if something ch something changed. All right, she left something here. Old transmitter. And of what does this old transmitter do? Nope. A model Vokia C53 <laughs> Vokia. online transmitter. <laughs> this Vokia, if you throw it into a wall, it probably breaks the wall as well. <laughs> Anyways. A model Vokia C53 online transmitter. I don't remember ever knitting a transmitter. An audio mixer to control the sound. Wrong combination. No. Was anybody in the need of a transmitter? A steel door model Zappa F40. Impossible to open without a code. Let me try Tina. Oh, Tina disturbs! <laughs> Seems like nobody's home. Alright. I, I, I mean, I didn't want it to do it like this, but I guess I have no other choice. Let's see what's too heavy. Too heavy, of course. Okay, let's. I mean, maybe I'm supposed to do it like this. I don't know. Who's bothering me? I'm here to show you some <laughs> vouchers about our Lord, <laughs> our Lord, Mr. Trump. Have you ever tried <laughs> bubbleware? I'm collecting funds to rescue mechanical stray cats. I mean... <laughs> what, can I... Can I try all of them? Let me try this one. 
I'm collecting funds to rescue mechanical stray cats. Not interested. This is going to keep bothering you. Who's bothering me? <laughs> I'm here to show you some brochures about our lord, Mr. Ruff. Oh, he'll get my boat anyway. I don't need those. I don't think this is our dead. Our, our dad worked for Ruff, but he didn't seem that he was on his side. You know what I mean? Seems like nobody's home. All right, let's try another one. Okay. Maybe I should... Maybe I should lead with Tino when it comes to gameplay, because if I didn't, you know... Reminded myself of, of switching to Tina. I would be here. I was stuck in here forever. So I'm just gonna stick with Tina. And then if I need to switch to Sam, I'll switch to Sam. And then I switch back to Tina because, as you can see, you can do more stuff with Tina than 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 Sam. So. Seems like nobody's home. Very well, another one. Seems like nobody's home. No problem. Home. Okay, let's try the other floors then. We still have two floors to go. Yeah, there were four. Yeah, two floors to go. Na, 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 na. Floor three. Here we go. Like nobody's home. Damn. Was 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 that door, that dude's door, the actual door? <laughs> Who's ringing? Uh, I don't think she's my dad. Have you ever heard? Have you ever heard about fandology? It's me, Julia. AC maintenance. It's me, Julia. It's me, Julia. I don't know any Julia. My bad. <laughs> Who's ringing? Have you ever heard about Vandology? Have you ever heard about Vandology? Not interested. Goodbye. I don't even know what that is. Is that even a thing? AC maintenance. AC maintenance. Are they sending kids nowadays? Yep. I don't trust you. Damn. <laughs> you do well. Nobody's home. Seems like nobody's home. Let's go. Or at least they're pretending they're not home. Okay. Third floor? No. Fourth fourth floor, yeah. I just wanted to see if I could progress a little bit on this one so that I could end the, the game a little bit more advanced, but I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to do it on this one. Then who's talking? It seems... I think it's this one. <laughs> then who's talking? Police open the door. I'm selling these matches. Then who's talking? Then who's talking? Uh, I'm the nanny robot. You don't sound like a robot. I'm very advanced. May I come in? Not really. I'm in the middle of a cyberspace session of TROD4. Now leave me alone.
Nobody's home. I'm selling these matches. I'm selling these matches. It's not even snowing yet. No way I'm letting you in. Goodbye. <laughs> Nobody's home. Police, open the door. Police, open the door. What? Are they hiring kids now? Get lost. <laughs> Let's see. Hmm. Nope. Nope. Hmm. Nope. Oh, yeah, I forgot about this. Wrong choice. Hmm. Wait, I already tried this one? Nope. Guess not. Damn it. It's not working this way. Okay, let's try another one. Seems like nobody's home. Is that you? Grandma? Is that you? I don't have any grandchildren! Leave me alone! <laughs> Who's there? Home Alone Elders Assistance! Home Alone Elders Assistance! I'm in great shape! No need for it! <laughs> Come on! <sighs> Who's there? You won the lottery, Aim! You won the lottery. I'm gonna act really? like a scammer. Out on Christmas Eve. Oh, okay. Yes, but the winners are kinda I'm acting like a scammer, man. Yes, but the winners are notified three weeks earlier. It's Christmas Eve today. No, it's earlier this year. Let's try the first one. Yes, but the winners are notified three weeks earlier. That's not how it works. You must be a scammer. Go away! Congratulations! You did it! <laughs> I'm still gonna try again. Because <laughs> I'm, I'm a dumb scammer. Who's there? Who's there? You won the lottery! You won the lottery! Really? I have the results out on Christmas Eve. No, it's earlier this year. No, it's earlier this year. This sounds like a scam. Go away. <laughs> Congratulations. Once more. Who's there? Who's there? You won the lottery? You won the really? It's Christmas Eve today. It's Christmas Eve today. Really? Yes. Yeah. I'm losing track of time. Be careful with scammers. They will always find new ways of fooling you, so be careful. Uh, tip, nobody gives you anything for free, so if you want something, it's BS. They cannot see that your computer has virus from far away, so if they tell you that your computer has virus, it's BS. Let's see another type of scam. There are probably more. If they say that they are from a company that you are signed in, check out with the company first. L uh, call for the number of the company. And if, they're, if they give you any numbers, don't use them. Go on the internet, search yourself for the actual official website. Usually has a locker on the left corner, left, top left corner of the screen, if it has a log, it's probably official site, and use the, um, the contacts there, 
contact contacted and ask if um, ask you got a you got a mail or a phone call about about something that their company said and they're probably gonna say it's BS so this is one of many ways I could be here all day to try to uh, help you not to be scammed <laughs> hey there's someone who looks just like me in one of these photos someone that looks just like you might she be the mother of our dad our grand my our actual grandmother our lots of buttons and screens to control the flat status that's it Sam, could you be a lamb and be in the middle of the... Thanks. <gasps> show the photo to the... Show her the photo. She looks like our mother, actually. Not working. Oh, come on. Damn it. Um... What? Who's there? I'm Tina. I guess I used to live here when I was very little. I'm Tina. I guess I used to live here when I was very little. But... I don't remember it very well. I'm searching for info about my dad. Oh, you sweet thing. I think I remember you when you were just a baby. I knew your parents, and when your mother, well, passed away, I was supposed to report you to the police, but you went missing. Yes. I lived just with Sam these past years, alone, hiding. But don't tell the police, please. Oh, I'll probably forget your visit five minutes after you leave. <laughs> so, can you tell me more about my father? I remember he disappeared. But I'm sorry. My memories are a blur. I can't be of much help. What I remember is that he had a very close friend. But I can't remember his name either. Blimey. Can I do something to help your memory? If you could find his name, the name of your father's friend, maybe it will help me remember who he was and where to find him. How can I get his name? You should visit the office where they used to work. There must be info about him and your dad there too. Here, take this signal disturber. Combined with an online transmitter, it should help you get rid of any bots in your way. Thank you. Goodbye. <laughs> Wait, but you had more. You had more. Wait! I, I'm gonna have to deserve the old lady again. Excuse me, ma'am. My apologies. Um, but you still had more things to say. What? I, la I laid about the Christmas lottery. It's not. Cr oh, she's being honest about it. It's so sweet. <laughs> yeah, go ahead, go ahead. <laughs> I lied about the Christmas lottery. It's not Christmas yet. Which lottery? <laughs> uh, and who let you win? You did. Are you a scammer? Did Rump send you to get my vote? No, no. About Dad's friend. About Dad's friend. She doesn't know what you're talking about. Where can I get info about him? <laughs> Sorry, my memory is gone. But yeah, I know, I know. One thing I'm sure about is that they worked there together. Okay, thanks. Goodbye. Okay. Take a nice nap. Sleep. Sleep. All right, so we know what to do now. We are going to combine the signal disturber with uh, with the signal uh, online transmitter let's see da, 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 da. nice nice and then we're gonna go downtown and uh, disturb the robot with with what we just did with that combination i don't know what's gonna happen to the robot it's probably gonna go bah, 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 bah. Okay, let's go.
please leave. Whoop, e bam. Hey! <laughs> He's he left. He left like a zombie. <laughs> um like a Frankenstein's creation. All right. The monster of Frankenstein. And we will go inside in the next video. Thank you so much for watching. Can't wait to see who who is our dad's friend. And why are they related? And why are they important? And what did they do? Yeah, let's figure out this mystery together. Thank you. And see ya.